Hey guys, Steph here. I'm like so rushing through trying to make videos. Today is actually July 6th. <laughs> I don't know when I'll actually get this video up. Watch it be like July 16th or something. I have a small haul and a July, 4th of July card that I seriously, I did make this before the 4th of July. So I'm going to just share the card real quick. This is the card and I just used a red A2 cardstock um, base. Then took some blue cardstock and I heat embossed from Lawn Fawn's Happy Fourth the different sizes and I uh, I used some white embossing powder, some Zing butter, some Stampin' Up's Pool Party, and some Sukuniko Candy Red, so that I had all different color um, embossed fireworks. Then down here, I used this EK Success Star Punch in white cardstock. Took, yes, I am right now. Then I took the star stamps right here and stamped them in blue and yellow. And then the red paper shows through the bottom there. And then up here, I heat embossed the Happy Fourth of July in the Sukuniko Candy Red. And then used the blue and yellow um, ink just to stamp some stars around it and cut it out into a little piece and pop that up. Super duper simple. The inside I just matted some blue paper then white and used the stamps again just to put let's celebrate. What about the red? This one here I used a light blue just to do the firework and then um, the boom part is up here. So super duper simple card that I'm late showing but that's okay. For my two little itty bitty hauls, the first one here is from the Stamps of Life. This month's stamp is called Awards Award to Stamp. And it's really cute because it's all solid and you can use circle uh, dies or punches to punch them out. So you get this here. And you could stamp it twice in different colors and cut them out. And then, number one friend, you're the best, way to go, keep your eye on the prize, you are awesome. It's your time to shine, number one, a solid one, and then a little tiny baby one. So super cute, and that's The Stamps of Life by Stephanie Bernard. Then, my other tiny thing, as always, my phone's going off, but that's okay, is I brought Ava to the aquarium, and then when we were done at the aquarium, we went to go eat at, um, out back and while we were waiting for them to open and everything you don't have to get the phone baby no, um we went into TJ Maxx and I grabbed just a couple little things I got the my mind's eye Where's my I don't know honey I check your room the my mind's eye nutmeg hanging out indie chic stamp set I have the girl one already which they had so I'm trying to get it so you can see. You get this border, you get the banner, the clock, the box, the date, check the office. Sweetness, family history, just hanging out, the circle, handsome boy, and the rose. And this was $1.99. And then I got thickers. <laughs> so I got the boardwalk thickers in the taffy color. And these are chipboard, but I love these. And these were all, as you guys know, $149. This one's not even marked, but they were all $149. Oh, oh. <gasps> guys, I'm so sorry. I would normally restart the video, but I just don't have time. I'm so sorry I dropped you. <laughs> Forgive me. Then I got the Lullaby Thickers by Crate Paper in Charcoal Foam. And I just love that gray color. And then I got the Fern printed chipboard, and this is like a pink and brown, but it's the Fern font. These are really fun. Then I got the Doll Thickers, and these are fabric chipboards, so they're fabric covered chipboard, and they have like a diagonal stripe going on there. Let me see if that'll focus. So when you take them out, you feel the fabric. It's really cool. And I love when they give you caps and lowercase. Then I got the Dear Lizzie Primrose Foil um, 
chipboard and these are the gold and white chipboard ones love the gold gold is very trendy right now and then these ones are really fun these are the Lindsay font and these are in the black with white polka dot chipboard so they're really cute I'll get close up for you guys to see the polka dots going on there isn't that adorable I love it so those are it there was another couple of thickers there but I so did not need to even be buying any so that's my itty bitty haul for now and my belated happy 4th of July simple card and that's it for now when I have time I have more to share but I've been trying to be good and with so much going on it's been easy to not shop like when you're super duper busy you don't really have a lot of time to sit and like shop online and stuff like I did before so it's a good thing I'm saving money I am waiting for a Simon Says stamp order uh, a, it's a very small one when they had the 20% off and um, I'm waiting for some winnings to come in because I did win some fun things and an envelope punch board to come in that I had pre-ordered forever and ever and ever ago so that's it for now I hope everyone's having an awesome summer thanks for watching bye